going on everybody? So today I am removing all the plastic paneling from inside my van. There's a big one on the side door, there's some on the back doors, and in order to get it out, you have to take off these little clips that are holding it on. Now these clips are plastic and they're super easy to break. Uh, don't worry if you break some, you can get them online. I'll have a link below. So far I haven't broken any, fingers crossed, but what I've been using is this little flathead screwdriver it's not a normal one, it's kind of bent, <laughs> but I've been using a little flathead screwdriver just to pry them off. It's been working like a charm so far, so let me show you what I'm up to. So I just removed the side panel. This is what it looks like without it. It wasn't hard at all. I used my flathead screwdriver. There's about a dozen or so clips. Um, next thing I'm gonna take off are the panels here. This will be easy, and then down here I'm going to be removing this from both doors and that's what we're up to so I just removed the back corner panel there's a handful of clips got them all out perfect and that's what it looks like also these middle panels on the back they do require a Phillips screwdriver just so you know, when you're getting your stuff ready to start taking panels off, you're going to need that as well. So a couple other things to know. I found out these small ones up here, they have clips on them as well. So just be careful when you're pulling it off that you don't break a clip in case you want to put it back up. And then um, when you're prying off these little plastic pieces, uh, whatever you're using to pry, make sure you're just using it like as leverage on the plastic itself. Don't use, don't try and pry it from the metal because you'll end up scraping the metal. <laughs> so there you have it. I have all the plastic pieces off and now I can start filling in behind them. <laughs> 